Hi, I am Roxana from VP State and in this video I will show how to translate VP Residence Team to another language. We have language files for different languages included in our child team. The child team can be found in our team pack. You need to install it and you will be able to take advantage of all the available languages. I will show how to install child team. Here I have the team pack. I will unzip. This is the child team that needs to be installed. You need to go to Appearance, Teams, Add New Team, Upload the team. Once the child team was installed, you need to activate it. For the language file to apply, you need to set the WordPress site language. My example will be with Spanish language. I will select Spanish. Save. The translations from the team will apply. To manage translations in language file, you can use a plugin like Local Translate plugin. I have the plugin already installed. This is the interface of the plugin. You can see here the site language, the active team, which is the child team. Team translation can be found in Team and in VP Rental Steam Core functionality plugin. I will show how to manage this translation by actually making an edit on existing translations. First, you need to open the translation file. In my case, since I use Spanish, this will be the file. Edit and look for any strings. For example, I will edit the translation for search button. I will look for English string search. You can change it. I will just add an edit. Save changes. You will need to clear cache to see the actual change. Here. I will do the same for a string in Team Core plugin. Usually strings from admin are included in language file from Core plugin. I will edit the translation for guest number. You need to go to plugins. Core plugin. Look for Spanish or your language file, edit, look for the string, this is the one, I will edit it, save, refresh, and you can see that the change applies. The language files from both child team and core plugin will need to be updated after each team update. This can be easily done by pressing sync button. You will have this message telling you how many strings were added or removed. You will need to do the same for the team language file. These are the steps that you need to take to apply the already translated language files, but also you will find in your site many other strings that are not in language file. For those, we will create a new video. I hope that you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching and do not forget to subscribe to our channel.